Hi everyone, welcome back to Small Engine Repair Channel. Today we have this Brinson Stratton Quantum Engine and this is belongs to a friend of mine. And the most common problem with the, with the Quantum Engine is when you prime, it won't start. And I'll tell you what's the problem. Okay, let's prime. And start the engine. Let's remove this air filter base cover. I'm using a carpet cleaner, just to spray this vent over here and start the engine. Surely the engine starts. So the problem with this one is the the primer base assembly. So all we need to do is to replace the primer base assembly with a new one so also we need to replace the air filter so let's do that to replace the air filter primary base assembly let's remove the top cover first using the m8 hex socket remove the two mounting bolts on the carburetor and one on the base assembly remove the floral mounting Now we can remove the primer base assembly. So let's clean and remove some of the gasket, old gasket, and let's clean and replace it with the new one. Okay, let's install this uh, primer base assembly. Let's not forget uh, connecting the breather. So this is our primer base assembly. I purchased this one ages ago from other uh, seller. So it comes with this white uh, float or cover. It's a different type of material, different construction, different manufacturer. And this one, that this is the one that we we have on stock. The this um, also a different manufacturer. So we have this one on stock, and this one we don't have this one. This is uh, from a different seller. So let's try this one first and let's see how it goes. For testing purpose, we can install the primer base assembly just only for the two mounting bolts. Without the filter, we should be able to start the engine. And to test the primer, um, when you prime, you should be able to see the fuel jet coming out from the the nozzle or from the from the jet. So at the moment it's not coming at all. So I'll show you. Okay, let's look closely on the the jet when I prime this one. So it's nothing. So it's guaranteed that this one won't work. Okay, let's prime. And start engine. That won't work. So just spray. So that's the problem with different type of uh, primer, primer base assembly. Let's try to replace this one with with our primer base assembly. Before we prime, we start the engine. Just to make sure that the engine won't start before priming. Okay, now I'll prime and then start the engine. So 
so it's working right. The main problem with this primary base assembly is this part here become warped and it's due to too much tension on the screw that tends the plastic to to deform. So how this priming works? When you prime, it pushes air through this slot here. So when you have this gasket in place, like that, so it seals the slot except this opening here. So the air only comes out through this hole and into the this side of the carburetor. So when you when you prime, it pushes the air into the chamber and it pushes the petrol through the jet. So I'll show you when I when I prime this one. Okay, let's complete this assembly this one. Set the throttle to fully run position and pull the throttle and tight this one. This priming really works well when you have this air filter fitted. And final test. Let's try it. Thanks for watching our video repair tutorial for today and I hope you find it useful and informative especially with this quantum engine and how this uh, priming works and how to fix it and I really would like to thank everyone for giving you all your support especially for today. We have achieved, I have achieved 999 subscribers and I need one more from you and I hope for that one support we will reach 1,000 subscribers and that is today so I'm very very happy and please continue your support please leave a comments likes and subscribe to our channel and I will promise I'll continue to provide you with a lot of informative information about a small engine and in the future with electric so thanks for watching and see you next time bye for now